share my screen. Wait, I need I need to share my screen. Yeah, you can share. Okay. Um, okay. Yeah. Hi. Uh, Introduce about yourself. Okay. Uh, okay. So I'm Kavya Navraj, and today I'm going to be presenting you a topic about the Vina. The instructor who teaches me is Karen Barshit, and I go to the Academy of At Atreya Academy. Wait a second. My PowerPoint isn't working. Yeah, okay, go ahead. Okay. Wait a second. Okay, good. Now it's working. Uh, okay, Vina, my Kavya Devaraj. Introduction. The Vina, which is also spelled Vina, comprises of various chordophone instruments from the Indian subcontinent. Ancient musical instruments evolved into many variations such as lutes, zithers, and arched harps. The many regional designs have different names, such as the Rudra Veena, the Saraswati Veena, and the Vichitra Veena, and others. Where the Veena came from. The Veena was found in India, but its origin can be tra tra traced back to the ancient Yap, a string instrument similar to the Grecian harp. The Vina went through several, in several innovations and modifications. In its current form, the instrument can be attributed to the Lagunath Nayak, 17th century of Tanjavur and Tamil Nadu, who invented Vina. In the ancient times, Narada is credited with inventing the Vina, but the Ashura v Ravana is said to invent the Rudra Veena because he was inspired and as well as his devotion to Lord Shiva or Rudra, he named the instrument Rudra Veena. How many strings does this typical Veena have? So as you can see, the Veena has four main strings which are melodic and three auxiliary drone strings. Another type of Veena named as Santur Veena or Shahantri Veena in Sanskrit has 72 strings. Also, a modern Rudra Veena has a total of seven or eight strings, and it depends on what type. What, what wood Veena is made from? The wood used to make the Veena is called a palamaram, or locally called the jackfruit wood. The entire instrument is called, carved on a single block of wood with different materials. Who is the best Vina player? There are various Vina players who are the best at playing this instrument, including Ravi Kiran, Vina E. Gayatri, Sundaram Balachandar, and so on are the most popular Vina players in the country. As Arsad Ali Khan was the best Rudra Vina player amongst the Hindus and he was an Indian musician who played the plucked instrument Rudra Veena. How to play the Veena? So to play the Veena, the musician has to pluck the melody strings downwards using his two fingers, the first and the second. The musician has to strum the drone strings with the help of the little finger on his play, off his playing hand. When desired, the resonating strings can be stopped with the free hand. The mythological importance of Veena. According to the Indian Vedic literature, Veena is one of the three principal music instruments along with the flute and the mridanga. 
Veena is also known as a queen of the Indian musical instruments. There are several mythological pieces of evidence showing pictures of Hindu gods and goddesses with Veena in their hands. The goddess of learning, the Saraswati, is considered to be the one holding the Veena. Summary. The classic Indian Veena is spiritual and has scientific importance as well. The Veena has many benefits that are beneficial and is one of the oldest instruments in ancient India. Playing the Veena might be hard, but when you learn the step, it, steps, it gets easier and easier. There are many different types of Veenas that have different benefits on the medical side and the calming side. Thank you. Okay, that's it.